Hi, this is Derek Gonzalez. Uh, gonna go over the auto sleeve placement. With our tool, you're able to automatically place sleeves uh, throughout a model um, and manually place sleeves and convert to box outs. Now this does work for walls and floors and linked models. Set this up, you'll go into your sleeve settings. And on the far left here, you'll have your selection filter. That'll let you select your duct and pipe. Uh, this is gonna be using our element filter tool. There's your categories, and here we're gonna have our parameters. So you can really define uh, what you're selecting if needed. Now here on the host, you'll see where I start using those parameters. I'm only gonna select walls with a two hour value. So that's me being able to use that element filter tool. The sleeves are gonna be RFA. And right here is where we have our oversizing for additional uh, sleeve length and width there. One thing we also do is evaluate for insulation as well if the items that you're placing on it does have an insulation. We have a box out rule here as well. This is something new that we've added. What that does is that it will look for the association method here. You'll see I have edge to edge, I have one foot. You can also have it center to center. If it is equal to or less than that value, it'll automatically convert multiple sleeves into a single box out. Last tab here is where you're able to select where those linked models or which linked models you're looking for the clashes with. Just have to hit that checkbox there. All right. Now, to run the tool, all I have to do is simply highlight the model and go and place auto place sleeves. You'll see I did place those. Up at the top, I'll have my individual and then you'll see I start to have these box outs here. Now, if you'll look, whenever I uh, go ahead and select this wall, it is only a one hour wall in my link model. Because of my rules, I said I did not want to place sleeves there. Now, what I can do if I do need to go back through and place them, is highlight those items and use our manual place sleeves. I can load from predefined rules or I can enter in my own values here and simply hit OK, and it'll go ahead and place those for me. Now you can see here, I do have some individual sleeves. If I wanted to, I could quickly select those as well and convert those to a box out. Same rule here, I can load from predefined or enter my own values, and it converts it for me. Now after all that is placed, all the sleeves, if I needed to export those points, all I need to do, we can zoom in. You can see I have points embedded in all my sleeves. So I can come up to my points manager, go ahead, select whatever uh, sleeves or points I need to renumber. Go ahead and renumber that here. And then very quickly hit apply and export. I do have that ability to export either to a CSV or TFL. If you'd like to see more or a demo of this, just visit our website, evolvemep.com. Thank you very much.